Hey guys, it's Jamie Scringer here. Today I want to talk about life as a stepmom. You know, every day I tell stepmoms that there really is no one size fits all approach to mastering step family life. What works for one step family may not work for another. Everyone has a unique family dynamic. However, that being said, I do really feel like there are five rules that every stepmom should abide by, no matter what their step family dynamic. And today I'm gonna to share them with you. Number one, before you start parenting your stepchildren, you need to build a relationship and even a friendship. There needs to be a foundation of trust and respect before you can expect them to trust you as a parental figure. Until you have that foundation set, take a back seat in the parenting department and just support your spouse behind the scenes. Number two is empathy. And this is huge in all areas of life, but especially important when it comes to step family dynamics. When you're in the midst of step family stressors, or even when you're just going about your day to day, take a step back and honestly think about how your stepchildren may be perceiving things. Think about how your husband's ex-wife perceives the situation. You don't have to agree with the way they're seeing the world, but honestly, taking time to just consider what their perspective may be can make the world of difference. Number three, treat your stepchildren's mom with respect. Even if you don't respect her, even if you can't stand the lady, even if she treats you like crap and doesn't respect you one bit, please just treat her with respect. She is an extension of them and treating her with respect means that you're treating them with respect. Honestly guys, the way I see it, your relationship with your husband's ex-wife should be one of two things. One, respectful and cordial or non-existent. If your husband and his ex-wife are getting into an argument, don't get involved. Your involvement probably isn't gonna make things better. So just be a support behind the scenes. Number four, it's not a competition. There's enough room for everyone in these kids' lives. You can never be loved by too many people. Number five, pick your battles. There will be times when you and their mom disagree. There will be times when you don't respect how she's going about something. There will be times when you have blips in your co-parenting road. There will be times that are really freaking challenging. Co-parenting is tough, it's not easy. Before you engage in any type of conversation about the conflict, I encourage you to ask yourself, does this really matter? I love the 555 rule. It has been a huge game changer for me in my step family life and in life in general. So before I get upset about something, I ask myself, will this matter in five minutes? Will this matter in five days? Will this matter in five years? And then I react accordingly. It is crazy how asking yourself those questions can really help put things into perspective. The one question that I often ask myself is, what do I want my children and stepchildren to remember about their childhood? I encourage you to ask yourself that question as well because my answer to that question has really helped shape the way that I parent and step parent our kids. And there you have it guys, the five rules that I think that every stepmom should abide by no matter what their step family situation. As always, don't forget to like, comment and share and I will see you in the next video. See ya.